All right, in this video, I'm going to go through um, this example problem, and I'll provide the link to this um, on uh, the description of this video, but this problem is coming from um, this open source textbook um, that the University of um, Massachusetts is putting out. And, um, and if you just want to quickly click on the solutions, I'll provide the link to that and you can see that. But I just want to talk through um, these problems here in this video. So um, let A, B, and C be three sets um, shown uh, an event diagram. Um, each of the following sets, uh, we want to go ahead and draw and shade the area that's represented by this, um, by what we have here. So starting with A, um, so we have A, union B, union C. Okay, so basically they just want us to show what this looks like in a Venn diagram. How would we do that? Okay, so um, I always draw our sample space. Okay, and then let's go ahead and draw three sets. So I have A, and then I have B, and then I have C. Okay, so um, let me go ahead and label these guys. So A, B, and C. So what does union mean? Union means you belong to A, or B, or C. So if you belong to any um, any of these three events, then you belong to the union, okay? So the way we would draw this in our Venn diagram is we would just go ahead and shade everything. Okay, so that's what union means. It's um, the event A or the event B or the event C, then you belong to the union, okay? So in red, I have the union between A, B, and C, okay? Um, for part B, we have the intersections. The intersections. So this is my sample space, and I have A, B, and C. Okay, so what does intersection mean? Intersection means and. Okay, so we need to belong to A and B and C. There's only one little spot that belongs to all three, and that's right here in the center, okay? If you wanna to belong to all three, then you have to be right here in this red little spot in the center, A, B, and C. Right. Um, for question C, we have, um, I'm gonna go ahead and just copy the question down. So I have A, union, B, intersection, C. Okay, let me scroll down and let me draw my sample space. Okay, this is my sample space. And I have event A, I have event B, and I have event C. Okay, so whenever you see parentheses, we have to do what's inside the parentheses first. Okay, so actually let me use like a purple for what's inside the parentheses. So I have B, intersection, C. Intersection means and. Okay, so and, B and C. That would be right here. Okay, then I have A, union, B and C. Well, what does union mean? Union means or. So that would mean I would belong to either A or this intersection, which is here, okay? So this red area that I've shaded in, this is what I see here, okay? All right, letter D. Let me scroll back up so I can look at it. D is A minus B intersection C. Okay, so what do I have going on here? This is my sample space. Okay. I have A. I have B. And I have C. 
Okay, so start with what's inside your parentheses first. Always start with what's in your parentheses. So once again, I have intersection, which is this spot right here. Okay, so what I want to do is now I want to take A and then I want to subtract out this pink area. Okay, so this is A, right? This is A, but I want to take away the pink area. So I have everything in A except for that pink area. Okay, so what I've highlighted here in red will be representing this. Okay, everything ex in A except for that pink area. All right, lastly for part E, I have A union. A union, and then I had, what was it? It was B intersection. C complement. B intersection, C complement. Okay. All right. So what do I have going on? I have A, B, and C. Okay. So let's see. Start with your parentheses first. So I have. B, intersection C. Intersection means um, and, right? So that would be this spot right here. Okay, so now I need the complement of that. The complement of B, intersection C. Okay, this is where things get a little hairy when we're drawing it. But basically, the complement will be everything else. Okay, so what I've done here is this in this tan color is this piece here. Okay, so now I need to do a union. Okay, what does union mean? It means or, right? So that means I have, I have to belong to the tan area, or I need to belong to a. Well, here's a. Right, this is A. Or, right, I need to belong to this tan area. Well, the tan area is like is is everywhere except for the elements that belong in both C and B. So everywhere except for this spot right here. Okay, if it belongs to A, then it does belong to this. But if it belongs to B and C, then it does not, right? Everywhere except for this pink area, okay?